Hi, I'm Rochelle, the founder of Godiva Secret Wigs, and welcome to the wig party. We're going to have our own personal party right now, so grab a cold drink, a piece of paper, and a pen, a comfy seat, because I am going to go through our top 20 wigs and wig colors, and as you like something, make a note and mark it down, okay? So, first of all, a couple of questions that clients have. Is this human hair? No, Godiva's secret wigs are never human hair. They are high quality synthetic wigs. They're open and airy and your scalp can breathe. They also are wash and wear. So if you wash them and condition them with our shampoos and conditioners, they dry the way you bought them. No rollers, no blow dryers. And that is the beauty for women that want convenience in wigs. So our clients own two to 20 wigs. I'm gonna start with short wigs and then go to long. All right, let's go. So the first wig is Sheila in ginger brown. I'm tucking my hair in and a wig always goes up to your hairline and then you even the tabs. Our wigs are made to have just a minimum of work done to them. And if you see a little blonde, you'll know that's my hair. So I'm not using any brushes, any hairspray. These wigs are exactly as you get them in. They're ready to go. So I'm just giving you an idea of the styles and what you can do with them. And with a short wig, it's great to just graze your fingers and you can piece those bangs, do whatever you like. Very light, under two ounces. The next wig is Selma in Creamy Toffee. So I start by holding a wig upside down and shake it. Then I'm holding the back I'm putting it on a little lower than my eyebrows. And then I slowly bring it up to my hairline and even the tabs. So this is Selma. And notice how I'm not brushing down, 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 although you may like it that way. The wigs are meant to just graze to go up and back. And it's just a great little look. So I could put it all behind my ears if I like. And just note that the bangs always come too long on our wigs. So then a consultant or your hairdresser can customize the wigs for your forehead, okay? Next, Peggy. Peggy in silver stone. And if you are into gray wigs, you've got to check out our top 14 gray wigs. But for now, I want you to see Peggy. It's very easy to wear. The backs all look so natural. As you can see, very little trimming has to be done. So silver stone, which is this color, has lighter in the front around the face and then goes darker in the back. Okay, so keep that in mind. We do other beautiful gray tones. Next, we're going to do Christy in Raspberry Ice. Raspberry Ice has blondes, different shades of reds, and check this Christy out. I forgot, Christy loves to go from right to left. So even if your hair parts a different way than the wig, just when you get a wig, play with it and see what it looks best the way you brush it. So try it every way. But what we love about Christy, make sure my tabs are even at my ears. What's great about Christy is this little dip of long hair. And again, it can be slightly trimmed, but you just take a little bit, but look how cute this cut is. Christy, Raspberry Ice. Next on our list is Tyra. Tyra in dark chocolate. It's a rich brown. And I want you to see what Tyra does. 
So this is how you start. But don't let this scare you because just playing and also committing a brush just to the wigs will keep the wigs looking and feeling cleaner longer because our own brushes have our hair dirts and oils and that's going to dirty your wigs quicker. So commit a brush just for the wigs, okay? So this is Tyra. It's a full little look in the back, but it's very light and airy. And remember that all of these are wash and wear wigs and most of them come in each other's colors. So say you love Tyra, but you want a different color. It probably comes in the color you like. Next, we have Kelly in Champagne with Roots. Kelly is a great wig. Don't be scared. So up at the hairline, even the tabs. And then what we love about Kelly are these long pieces right in front, right around your face. Remember, you could put some bangs in here, but wait till you see the back. So some clients will want their Kelly trimmed even shorter or put it behind their ears I'm kind of looking in a mirror while I'm playing and showing you, and this is what you do when you get a wig. Don't be quick to judge it. First, play with it. Brush it different ways. So I can take Kelly, take it completely the other side for a part. See what I just did right there? Just dip it. And I can decide, you know what, I still like it better the other way. And I can trim these pieces shorter. But I want to talk about champagne, see what looks like roots. And even if you say, well, my roots aren't dark, they're gray, or I don't have roots. Right now, we're talking about the illusion of great looking wigs. So the illusion is, I almost need my hair colored. And so roots really make a wig look very natural. And what I love to do is even put some sunglasses right on top of any wig and you just blend into society. And that's all our wigs are about, really, is not having you stand out, but have you look at the top of your game with wigs. Unless you wiggle your wig or you take it off, no one's going to know you're wearing a Godiva secret wig. Next, we have Nina in Iced Mocha. So especially with Nina, I like to shake it and remember, don't be scared when you first see it. So I'm not going to walk anywhere like this, but I'm going to take it up to my hairline. I'm going to even the tabs, so I'm holding right here the tabs. And then with Nina, first I love to smooth out the front. Some of you ladies there, you love your big hair, so I'm going to take a quick circle so you can see it. But now I want you to see how I tone down Nina, just with my fingers, making sure my hands are clean and not greasy from touching my makeup. Again, you want to keep your wigs as clean as possible. So look how great Nina is. And this color is Iced Mocha R. It's a fantastic color. Blends of a little blonde, the browns, and those little blondes just really perk up the brown, give you a little lightness to your face. Cute, right? Okay, let's keep going. Our next wig is our most popular wig all over the world in the most popular color, and that is Freedom in Nutmeg F. So let me show you. Up at the hairline, even the tabs, this is the first wig I had on at the beginning of this wig party video. And I want you to see just how easy it is, that little gentle tickle at your neckline, and it's just so easy to put on and wear. And so Freedom comes in all of these colors that you're looking at. It's a wonderful addition to your wig wardrobe. Next. 
we are doing Trixie in Mochaccino. And Trixie, I would call the little longer sister of Freedom. And you'll see why. They're very similar. But you'll see how Trixie is a little longer right here, right around the cheeks. And it's a great little easy wig to wear. What I love to do when I'm wearing Trixie is show a little ear on this side and a cute earring and then leave this piece in the side long. What do you think? Isn't that great? Trixie. Next, we have something really fun. This is Sabrina for those of you who like a page boy. Maybe you have long hair, but you want something a little different. This color is Irish Spice. And for those of you that have red hair or color your hair red, you know how hard it can be to keep your color. I've been red, and every day I'm looking as my red starts from a burgundy and ends up orangey red. Instead, I have wigs. So this is Sabrina. Look how fun and easy this is. Also, I want to remind you, none of these wigs are human hair wigs. Godiva's Secret does not carry human hair wigs because our business model is convenience for you. So we don't carry thousands of wigs. We carry wigs that look real. And we want something that will wash and wear and always keep its style. My own hair, it will frizz if I'm on a cruise or in the rain or when it's damp out. But our wigs will never frizz. So that's something great for you to know. The fiber of our wigs is the highest quality synthetic fiber and it's called Kaneculon. And it is what makes it curly, wavy, whatever we like, we choose our styles and our colors for the masses of you all over the world. So we hope that you're enjoying this wig party so far. Okay, let's go on to the next. I'm going to take you into Alana in Silverstone. This is a really great wig. Very light. So remember, when you're putting your wigs on, you put this on in front of your loved one and they're going to say, take that off your head. All you have to do is slowly bring it right up to your hairline. And it makes a complete difference. <laughs> and this, again, is Silverstone. It is beautiful. Our gray wigs are beautiful and sexy. And look how this baby moves. Remember, you can put bangs into it if you like. This is Alana. And Alana is great in browns, in reds. It just falls really easily. Remember that you can put it behind your ears if you like. You can pull it up and clip it. Put a little cute clip. Put your sunglasses. And away you go. Our next sweet wig is Tiffany in Coffee Latte. So I actually wore Tiffany to my son's wedding a few years ago because I was wearing a really beautiful, elegant dress. And to me, my straighter, flatter hair just didn't work. I wanted something that really gave me lift. And Tiffany, look at the height, the airiness of this wig. It's just great. And remember, these wigs haven't been touched, trimmed, brushed, nothing. These wigs resemble exactly the wigs that you receive when you open your box and you get your wigs. So just know that. Coffee Latte is a great color because it's got almost cream in its coffee. It's got these little caramel pieces. So keep that in mind if you're a brunette and you want a little slight weaving in with your brown, okay? So, Tiffany. 
What do we have? Oh, Katie in maple sugar. I shake almost every wig, and when I put a wig on, I always hold it where you have adjustable straps. You can make the wigs tighter or looser. Katie, maple sugar. I'm using my thumbs just to tuck my hair in. Whoa! So, Katie, up at the hairline, even the tabs. And Katie has that great, messy, some people call it that bedhead look. Some women want their hair really messy and fly away. I like to tone it down a little bit. I would just barely trim those bangs, very barely, just a little bit. But our wigs are machine teased at the root, so see this little height? It's great, and check out this color. It is beautiful. This is Katie. Something really fun to do with Katie, different ways to wear, now we're getting into little longer wigs, is to pull up and clip, clip it back for a little height, or you can put it in a little ponytail down low, bring a few pieces forward, play with it, have fun, and make it yours. Make it the style so when you look at yourself in the mirror, you get a little tickle. You feel great. You know, so many clients of ours are absolutely beautiful from here down, but their hair does not complete the woman they want to be in their world. So our wigs just really enhance who they are. And it's so amazing to see transformation, see so many pictures of all of you from all over the world. Thank you so much. And this is what Danielle and I are committed to and our consultants is making a difference in other women's lives. Okay, so let's continue. I have Kayla in Vanilla Bean. Now Kayla is a lace front wig and I'm going to show you what that means. So I'm going to put it a little lower so that you can see I'm going to slowly bring this up to my hair line. And lace front means that there is a piece of lace actually at the hairline. And you want to treat these wigs, actually all wigs, like beautiful expensive lace lingerie because you want them to last. And a lace front is delicate, so please keep that in mind when you are playing with your wigs, wearing them, taking them off. They're, they're beautiful pieces. So this is Kayla. It's a very modern look. Remember, every wig doesn't look perfect on me. I'm just your model for today, okay? So see, vision it on you or on people that you know. You may have women that you know in your world going through hair loss challenges, or they went to a hairdresser who cut their hair too short, or they're tired of their roots showing all the time, or they're going through something traumatic, uh, and as a result, the stress is causing their hair to come out. That's what these wigs are about. So our clients, our women, can stop whining about their hair and instead wake up in the morning and decide, hmm, who do I want to be today? That is the freedom of our wigs, Godiva's Secret Wigs. So, Kayla. She is so cute and natural, so I think you would love her. Okay, we're getting closer to the end now. We're getting a little longer. This is London in Chocolate Kiss R. So this is a rooted wig. Even though it's brown, it's got a little bit of root meaning the root is a little darker right at the roots. So this is London. And remember, we could have trim a little bit of bang. I can put it behind my ear. I can just wear it kind of just flat and simple.
pretty great wigs, right? It's fun to try something new. You know, everyone has a story when they keep their hair the same decade after decade. And our friends and our relatives and even ourselves, we kind of put us in a box. So I think wigs are so freeing because the truth to me is there's a lot of women in me and in all of you besides the one walking around in your hair or your hairstyle or color. So it's so freeing to try something new. This is Rochelle in Almond Spice. And it's named after me because my hair used to look this way. I love it and it's just full and got to bring it up to my hairline, right up to my hairline. Remember that when you're putting your wig on, making the shirts even at the tabs. And I can put bangs in this or I can again pull these sides up, give myself some height. Isn't that great? I see you nodding yes, you like it. A really fun wig is Rochelle. In every color, in rooted colors, it's fantastic too. So you might want to add this to your selection or jot it down. And if you purchase your first one or two wigs, but you liked six or you wrote them down, suggestion, just tuck that somewhere, put it in a file marked Godiva Secret Wigs. And so in the future, you'll remember what you liked because starting again takes a little time. So right now we are going through our top 20 styles and our top 20 colors. Let's see what we have here. Beautiful Jenna, it's called Jenna, in copper glaze. Copper glaze is a beautiful color, and Jenna is kind of like some famous starlets. I don't look like her, but you'll see it's just that little height and that wispiness right around the face, and it's such an easy wig to wear. I'm kind of moving my head a little bit so you can see it move. Sometimes, Instead of just cutting this, I will put it behind my ear. See how that just changed the look of the wig? Maybe cut a couple of little wispies right here between my eyebrows. And again, just picture it with your sunglasses up here. And it's great, isn't it? Ready to go, it's really easy. You're gonna have so much fun. I can't wait to hear what you purchase and how you enjoyed it. Okay, we've got Diana Lace Front in Frosted Taupe. Wait till you see Diana. So again, it's a lace front wig. I'm gonna show you what that means again. And this color, it's fantastic. So right now, I kind of look like wolf woman, but watch what is happening when I raise this hairline up. Look at that move right up to my hairline. So it looks so natural. You can just show your forehead. It is the easiest cut, just really casual, but I feel it really makes my clothes look great and just really easy to wear. Frosted taupe is an amazing color. If you're coming in gray or white and you kind of want to move that way but slowly, this is just a beautiful beigey with starting some of that light, light white or gray, just a hint of it and it's so flattering. So I can still take it behind my ears, trim a little bit, and I'm ready to go. See how easy that was? Okay, two left, and then I wanna hear what you're going to purchase. So this is Taylor, one of my very favorites 
and creamy toffee are. Look at this color and look at this wig move. I love Taylor. Actually, I own four Taylors. My husband's favorite colors on me are red, 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 and red. But having my own hair red is the biggest pain in the tush. So I own red wigs, but I also own Taylor in this color, in a dark brown we call chocolate swirl. I have it in Nutmeg F. And isn't this the easiest, greatest wig, Taylor? So I love this little wispiness, this little fringing around the face. And again, I could, or you could, just simply pull it up and clip it. See how natural that looks? Trim the bangs just a little bit. I like to tease it up here at the root for a little extra height. And just nick those bangs. We like to trim the bangs, we say, so it looks like you almost need a haircut, but not quite. But if you leave these hairs and they're falling in your eyes, it will make you crazy, seriously. So barely, barely trim those bangs until they're not in your eyes when you blink, okay? And our last wig, but definitely not the least important, is Candace. And this color is Chocolate Swirl. Wait till you see it. So ladies, some wigs don't leave the bedroom. It's okay. It's your secret, okay? But really fun to bring something new and different and unexpected in your relationship. So years ago, I lived in Candace just like this at this length. Now that I'm older, this wouldn't look right and I would be uncomfortable. But it doesn't mean you can't take Candace to your hairdresser and have it trimmed about to here, about like Taylor's length. And this is just the beautiful part of this wig, but I want to turn around and show you. It's so fun to wear. And get dressed up unexpectedly for your partner. And have some fun. Be Candace. That's the fun and the magic of Godiva's Secret Wigs. Chocolate Swirl, which is this color, is amazing because it's got the brown base with a little blonde and a little red right around the face. And if it is your color, you could leave some of your hair just a little bit around your face and then pull it up, create a fall effect, leave a few wispies hanging down. You can do that with any color wig that kind of matches your hair color. And while we're on hair color, ladies, if you find a wig and you love the color, then take it to your hairdresser and say, please make me this color. But it doesn't stop there. You want to always take that wig or hair piece with you the next time and the time after and after when it's color time and say to your hairdresser, keep me this color. Because you want that color and it's easy for a hair colorist to want to be a little creative or to have forgotten to write notes of how did she get the perfect color. So the visual is much easier for a hairdresser than the words. So I hope you enjoyed our private wig party, Just Us, and I'm encouraging you to check out our wigs, the most amazing wash and wear wigs in the world. You'll love them and just enjoy, let yourself experience the magic of beautiful wigs like Godiva's Secret Wigs. See you, bye.